Hi teammates, take a look at this film when you get a chance. The Canary Murder Case right here. Um, look at the plot and they make Charles the dad in this movie. And uh, when I was little, my dad and my grandpa made me watch The Edge, um, a film that came out in the 90s. And uh, I watched it in Michigan and I got kind of scared and um, it has a lot of symbolism of the Hopi, the Blue Kachina, um, and not having ego and having the staff of a spear and all that stuff. So and remember the bear represents red Russia um, or being being like red, like those sacrifices that we've talked about that uh, the Jews in Hollywood do the sons of Belial. So they make Charles the dad and Jimmy um, ends up getting away um, after being accused of some stuff, um, killing this canary girl. Um, so I'll show this here. The canary girl is played by Louise Brooks as Margaret Odell, the canary. And... Philo Vance plays William, is played by William Powell. So it's kind of like Philo Van Key. Um, so kind of like Seven and Van Key, like, um, like, like Seven, Phil, and O, like Four, you know, the, um, the snake of Revelation 315, or excuse me, Genesis 315 would be the O there. So that's like 47 would be the Phil O or 74. So 47 backwards. And van key is like, um, when I had a, I had my mom's van, I would always go kind of fast in it. So it's kind of like Paul Walker symbolism there. And he shows up with, um, this guy here, um, played by, let me find it. Um, Eugene Pallet, played by Eugene Pallet, Sergeant Ernest Heath. Can you believe that? Look at that. Look that up. Sergeant er Ernest Heath. Ernest Heath plays Eugene Pallet, and or is played by Eugene Pallet. So I went to Eugene Pallet, and he's he's very interesting. Um, this is a reincarnation sign that I got. This could be me. This could be you. So just keep faith. Um, he did a lot of silent pictures and he was a leading man at first, but then he became a stock character because he gained a lot of weight and he had a controversy with a black man calling him the N word. And, um, he got fired from the movie for that. So I thought that was crazy symbolism too. So don't make it about race. Just keep faith and don't be racist. Um, this man was kind of racist and um, he died of throat cancer. And uh, later in life, he um, he had a, um, he, he thought there was going to be a world blow up by atom bombs. So he he set up a mountain fortress in uh, Oregon. Look that up in later life there. Later life. Um, so very interesting, you know. Um, he was kind of a prepper, so he, he was a believer in Jesus for sure. He believed in end times, you know. And um, so the Canary is played by Louise Brooks. So I went to Louise Brooks and... Her birthday is November 14th, 1906. So, and she was in a movie called Beggars of Life. And if you go on her profile, this, this page here, um, you can see where she did Beggars of Life. Brooks played an abused country girl who kills her foster father after, or in a moment of desperation. A hobo, Richard Allen, or Arlen, 
happens on the murder scene and convinces Brooks to disguise herself as a young boy and escape the law by riding the rails with him. In a hobo encampment or jungle, they meet another hobo, Wallace Beery. Brooke's disguise is soon uncovered and she finds herself the only female in a world of brutal, sex-hungry men. So, some crazy symbolism there. And I, So that's Beggars of Life. And Beggars of Life came out in um, September 22nd, 1928. So keep faith, don't do anything crazy, and I'm not saying anything against anyone. I'm just showing the symbolism. So keep faith and look at everything with a mercy mindset. Um, the woman of Revelation 12 has uh, gone through a lot of things and probably been deceived. You know, whoever she is, she's been, the the world has tried to deceive her for a long time, you know. And if it, if it's the church, then we've been we've been uh, almost deceived by the world, you know, a, a lot of times. And um, that's just the way it is. So, and the woman, people have a lot of theories about who she is, but this movie shows how the woman could have been tricked into some stuff. And um, so I did 11-14-1906. That's... Um, Eugene, that's Eugene's date of uh, birth. Or, um, hold on, let me see what that is. Okay, November 14th, 1906 is Louise Brooks. Okay, so Louise Brooks' uh, birthday to 9-3-1954. That's uh, Eugene, um, the guy who played Heath. That's his... Uh, death, okay, and it's 